you are perhaps new to the LXI software and you have been using another software package for years. You've done all this work for all those customers. How do we get those files into your brand new LXI software? The good news is that the LXI software allows us to open or import most of those files. The difference between opening a file versus importing a file is that importing will place the file in the current drawing. Opening a file will open it as an independent file and then save it as an LXI format file, leaving the original imported file untouched. To view a list, simply click either the Open File button or the Import button. In this case, Import. This opens a window where we can navigate to the location of our file. At the bottom is where we can choose the type of file to import. The default setting is All Readable. This means that if it is not readable, then it won't be displayed in the window above. But if we click on the side arrow, we can see a list of acceptable files. The list, as you can see, is quite extensive. We have common files such as Adobe Illustrator, PDF, Photoshop, and CorelDRAW. There are also older legacy file types, such as Casmate, AutoCAD, and Inspire. There are also other signed software file types, such as Gerber, FlexiSign, and others. We'll leave it at All Readable for right now. If we select a file, such as this Airborne Illustrator file, it displays the contents in this window here. We can click Import to import the file we want, and then it will allow us to place the contents anywhere in our drawing area. We can position it where we want, and then click once to place it. From here, we can work on it, and then save it as an LXI file. Let's delete this for right now. We can open these files directly. If we click on the Open button in our standard toolbar, the Open File window appears. It looks almost like the Import window, except when a file is chosen, it opens the file itself as a document. It will then save it automatically as an LXI file. As an example, let's click the Open button. It opens the file as a document. Watch what happens when we click the Save button. If we click on the Open button, Notice that we still have the Illustrator file, but also an LXI file of the same name, meaning that it was saved as an LXI file, leaving the Illustrator file untouched.